the Democrats win. Now, what's interesting about, about the victory in, in 76, it was narrow. I think it was a little over 50 percent of, uh, of, of the vote that, 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 Carter, uh, that Carter got. You know, but the majorities in the Senate and House remain. And so Carter then is the president under conditions which are approaching Lyndon Johnson's in 1964. In other words, he has good majorities in, in both houses. Now, that encouraged many Democrats to think, aha, the economy is getting better. We can do a whole reform agenda, right? I mean, so they, they, they want to do what, what, what are they? National health insurance, consumer energy, labor reform, maybe a little tax reform, certainly a tax stimulus, Humphrey Hawkins, in other words, uh, you know, full employment. In other words, the Democrats misread the economy, too, in part because they were never forced to do it, especially with the new leadership. You know, you know, which is more suburban, it's more affluent, you know, you know, than the working class. But nonetheless, there is this notion that the economy is fine again, and so we can complete the reform agenda of the 